Dozens of communities across Indiana are considering needle exchange programs to help stop the spread of disease. And today, leaders in Allen County met to further that discussion. News Channel 15's Gina Claros has today's story for your well-being. Gina? It's called the Blue Ribbon Panel. It, it's an effort to bring the who's who of city and county officials together to combat those alarming numbers. From 2014 to 2015, the county saw a 60% increase in hepatitis C, and HIV rose by 30%. We're in uncharted territory with the high rate of opiate addiction, both legal and illegal, the high rate of IV drug use. 14 people with varying opinions sat around one table today to discuss preventing the spread of diseases and how to find middle ground. You've got the legal community and you've got the medical community who are looking at this thing from uh, two different perspectives. And then you've got to weave the social fabric of this community. The meeting resulted in a couple of ideas. If the program goes through, health officials could give one new needle for each termed in. What's happening in some communities is they're not taking in very many needles, but they're giving out a lot of needles. What we want to be able to do just to be able to quantify the success of the program is uh, is look at it potentially on a one for one for one basis and testing right now there is no requirement for those needing a new needle sheriff gladio who says the program goes against what he stands for does believe in tracking and testing i am not uh, 100 percent against this needle exchange program I, don't get me wrong there it's just i want to see you know through my years i've seen programs come and go because they weren't implemented correctly or they weren't followed up with, with so if, if they're going to add some of these other things with the needle exchange program, I'm, I'm all, I'm, I'll be all for it. I'm 100% sure that we will come up with some collaborative approach. Now, the Department of Health is checking to see if it can legally drug test and do the one-for-one -one needle exchange. If they can, officials will meet in the next couple of weeks. In Studio 15, Gina Galeros, News Channel 15.